Hey everyone, welcome back to another training video. And in this one, we're going to pivot and discuss a few of the many ways to georeference your project in RealWorks. So let's get right into it. First things first, make sure you have your project open with all stations visible. Next, go to the Home tab in the top left corner and click Import to import your control file into the project. When importing your control file, ensure that the file type is a surveying network ASCII file. Once the correct file is chosen, click Open. Ensure you have the right unit system selected and click OK. Now your control points should be visible in your project. We will discuss two tools that allow you to georeference your project in RealWorks. The first tool is located in the Registration tab. After navigating to the Registration tab, click the Georeferencing icon. This tool allows you to assign known coordinates to a target by clicking on the desired target in Step 1, then clicking By Target located below in Step 2. Next, you will be presented with a screen requiring you to either manually enter the northern, easting, and elevations of each target or to match the topo point that corresponds to its target. You can complete this process for each target and topo point. Also, RealWorks georeferences in a one-to-one -one scale, so it is recommended that you work in your local or ground coordinate system. The other tool, which allows you to automatically georeference your project, is located in the Registration tab. Click Target-Based Registration, and your control points will automatically match to the corresponding targets. Note that RealWorks does not yet offer a registration report, but your overall residual error will still be displayed. Lastly, click Apply, and your work here is done. Thank you all again for tuning in. I hope this video was super insightful and please like and comment for what type of content you'd like to see next. Cheers.